would take years. Whereas the internet censorship is technical. It could be removed in, in uh, a click uh, on a mouse. So I was focusing on that. When the deposit uh, events and uh, uprisings happen, um, uh, what uh, was interesting for me was the fact that people, the first day when they got to the street, they were they were pretty peaceful. We, we were so in, uh, seeing the, the videos on, on the internet of people uh, uh, peacefully demonstrating. At the second day, there were no more demonstrating peacefully. They were burning cars, uh, and there is. Uh, there was this guy, this young man, was talking to the camera, uh, cell phone camera, and, it, and he was saying, uh, uh, you see, yesterday we demonstrated peacefully, uh, pacifically, uh, and uh, nobody cared about it. There was no news about what, we, what happened here. We're not dogs. Why uh, the government and everybody uh, ignores us? Uh, how our world would uh, get to the ear of the governing people if nobody talks about them. So it was an issue of freedom of expression and uh, of censorship. So we took on ourselves, of, uh, on ourselves on the internet to cover what was happening there. Lina uh, got to uh, CDBZ to film uh, everything. We organized logistics to take the films from uh, movie when, when internet was cut from Chili Buzi, organized logistics to take uh, the movies from there to Tunis and to broadcast them. So, and we basically used the same the logistics we used for the, uh, and the, the same people uh, uh, for the demonstration against censorship in May 2010. Okay.